You've seen this before, Premier League fans. In 2015 and 2016, most models updated way too slowly on Leicester as they were marching toward the title, and way too slowly as Chelsea was dropping toward the bottom of the table. To be fair, it was incredibly hard. I mean, Leicester weren't just a preseason long shot, the famous 5,000 to one betting odds. They were widely projected to be at the bottom of the table. Almost nobody had them in their top 10 priors. When they started climbing though, many models still lagged even halfway through the season. My model had Leicester projected third after 20 games, but most of the modeling world was still expecting them to fall away. And here's the thing, even when some models did update, the updates weren't always welcomed. Sometimes the narrative just wanted to stick with the old story. There's no way Leicester can do this. They are not a big six side. That's not what happens in the English Premier League. And that's the danger of hanging on to a prior when the evidence is piling up against it. Jamie Vardy scoring more and more goals, Leicester's winning more and more games. Eventually it seemed inevitable, but models and our minds did not catch up. A good Bayesian model to update carefully, then calibrating when new evidence keeps coming in. 